Hi, we're at Extreme Metal Products in Cleveland, Ohio. Today we're going to be mounting up a rear bumper on a Kawasaki T2. As you can see, the T2 is a little different than T4. Back end's different, makes a different part number. Uh, this is part 13227. As you can see, the bumper is laser cut, CNC formed to ensure a perfect fit. All the corners are well and ground smooth. And then we finish it with a texture powder coat. You're also going to get two mounting brackets, as you can see here. These are going to mount in the bottom with the Torx bit self-threading screws. There's holes already in the frame. They go up into the frame. Once you have those into place, it also comes with quarter-inch self-tapping drilling screws. These can be drilled into the side also. So if you look under here, you can see it mounted into place. We still have to put these screws in. The self-threaders are in the bottom. Usually you want to leave everything loose to last. And then you mount the bumper up here like this. Then you're going to get carriage bolts, six total, and six nylon nuts. You're going to put two per side on the top, one here, and then one on the bottom. And you put the nuts on the back side. And this is from Extreme Metal Products in Cleveland, Ohio. Thank you.